Hey guys, it's Carrie. Welcome back to my channel. And today we're going to be, um, I don't know, this is kind of like a retro unboxing. Not really sure if you want to consider it retro, but it's definitely not new on the market. So I have one of the multiple variations of the 30th anniversary or 30th birthday Cabbage Patch Kids. Um, there was only 30, uh, 3,300 of these made. And, uh, this is, uh, number 19. 86 or 1968 sorry uh they are for ages three plus uh these ones are were exclusive to toys r us at least in our area and um they come with a bowl and a spoon versus the 25th anniversary that just came with a spoon it has a really nice box this has been in the box for a while and we have since decided that we we're going to open it up but I'll show you on the back here. It's got the legend. You can pause that and read it if you'd like. Uh, down here it tells you exactly what it comes with. And then uh, the design is a little bit metallic -y, um, At least the 30th is. And we have all these all this birthday stuff all over it. It really is nice to display in the box. We have since run out of space four boxed dolls. So we're, we're slowly starting to unbox them, I believe. So we're going to go ahead and get her out of the box, and we're going to take a look at her uh, outfit in a little bit here. Uh, I don't know what mold this is, but this is a different mold than the one that we have previously unboxed. And this girl's name is um, Kelsey Parker, says in there. And she was born on July 16th. So here is a close-up of her accessories. This is her birth certificate. It's pink for girl, and it says certificate and adoption papers and it says this certifies that Kelsey Parker is born on in the Cabbage Patch Kid on July 16th. Her birthday is coming up. Uh, I don't know. And then we have um, this very hard plastic silver dish. Also like the 25th anniversary they also came with a spoon that has the Cabbage Patch Kid design on it. It's silver as well. Um, the bowl was new to this edition. These are the 30th edition, so. And here is Kelsey Parker. She is wearing a... I don't know if you want to call it a four-piece outfit. She has a, a pink flowery headpiece on. And with... She has, like, a red... She has a red head with green eyes. She smells like amazing powder. And let's see her outfit. She has this clear, silvery, gray, removable jacket here. And a matching dress for her hairpiece. Uh, Eli opened her and said that all this sparkle kind of glitter bombed when he opened it. And this is a couple layers here. So this is the tool with the glitter. That's transparent. And then it's on top of the... Um, it's like a ribbony type material. Um, very nice with a, a matching uh, bow here. And then we have silver sandals. Look at the bottom. They're really cool. The flower. All the different flowers. Uh, and she is wearing some silky underwear. And of course, I don't know what head mold she is. Let's Let's check that out. On the back here, um, it does say 2013. Jack's on the back, and do not have a mold number on the back. I guess we don't have a mold number on the back. I guess I didn't do that with. Okay. She has a bright green, like a neon green, Xavier Roberts bum sticker, and a silk tag. This is Cabbage Trash Kid on it right there in purple. And she is big. And obviously she has a vinyl head and a stuffed body. But she's one of the last of the Mohegans when it came to the size factor. My guess is that she was supposed to represent, because she was a Toys R Us exclusive, She's probably supposed to represent the true kids that used to exist back in the day. I think I feel like she was sixty to seventy dollars 
Might have been 50, but I think she might have been 60. Uh, and that's all we have for you guys today. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe, and we will see you in the next one. Bye, guys.